uh, this is Sports Broadcasting Camp. Today, I'm Hanwin, Shalon, Connor, and Declan. And today we are discussing the training camp fight between the New York Giants and the Detroit Lions. And more specifically, that is about Kirby Joseph and rookie receiver from LSU, Malik Neighbors. And there's already been a scruffle at practice, or in that joint practice, between those two teams. Yeah, I mean, yesterday's involved definitely involved more players. Including Daniel Jones, which was a quarterback for yeah, the Giants. Yeah, you know, yeah, I mean. Yeah, well, I'd, I'd just like to point out that, you know, while it is a little bit surprising that this fight occurred, uh, they aren't uncommon. I remember a couple of years ago when the Rams and Cowboys had a joint practice and they fought. So, you know, th- these things happen all the time. And, you know, while, while they're rare, they're also really unavoidable. Yeah, I mean, it's already happened twice this season with players in the same team, Texans and Dolphins, in training camp. And earlier this year it happened... Last season, it happened during a game, I mean, multiple times. There was one between the Cowboys and Chargers before their Monday night football game. Yeah. And if you have any take on this, free field to call our number. It's 555-555-5555. And I, I, we're going to call it right now. We're on the line. Oh, yeah. So I was just going to ask, even with the scuffle that happened, the joint practices, do you guys see this taking a huge blow on either of their seasons, and what are your predictions moving forward? Absolutely. I don't think this is a big issue. I mean, sure, this, this definitely shouldn't happen. Of course, it's always an embarrassment to the teams, but I honestly don't think it will really affect any team publicity. Everyone will probably forget about it in a few days, and you know. Yeah, I, I don't think this is going to have, you know, almost any effect on each team seasons because they happen all the time and you know it, it's it's two teams and it, they rarely play against each other in the regular season and wow. it's yeah I, I just don't think that's going to be the case and unless uh, it gets serious to the point where a player gets injured in the fighting or someone gets, criminal gets charges. yes or someone gets charged or suspended with or suspended for anything uh, that happened in the fight I don't see it significantly impacting either team. Yeah, I agree. These things, you can't avoid them. There's just stuff that's going to happen. I feel like the most notable incident is in the 2022 offseason once the Bengals and Rams had the joint practice together. That was an absolute mess, but the teams got over it. Okay, thank you. All right, we got to wrap it up. Uh, for all of us uh, here at... Uh, SBC Sports Talk Radio, Hanwen, uh, Shaolin, and Connor. I'm Declan. Thanks for watching.